Okay, so somebody asked, when to remove farm work from concrete members? That's a good question and basically this depends on some factors such as gradient type of concrete, concrete admixtures, farm work type, curing conditions, concrete quality, and the surrounding temperature, and uh, how heavy the structure is, and something such. Also remember the time from which the concrete is placed in farm work till the time the farm work is removed is called is the supporting period. This time period can be different based on different factors discussed just few seconds ago. Still however, the following table is recommended in many construction books which shows the minimum supporting period of concrete farm work in normal temperature. Like as you can see in the same table, the first column represents the type of work and the second that represents the farm work removal time or you can say the supporting period. And this is actually minimum, okay? This should be more, or you can say um, the supporting period can be more than the uh, represented values, okay? Like as you can see in the same table, the farm work should be removed after 24 hours to 48 hours from the sides of walls, foundations, columns, and vertical faces of the beam. Again, farm work should be removed after 7 days from the slaves spanning up to 4 meters and slaves spanning more than 4 meters then the farmer should remove after 14 days and actually these days are the duration of the supporting period this is actually minimum okay and should be more now farmer should be removed after 14 days from the beams and arches spanning up to 6 meters and finally the farmer should be removed after 21 days from the beams and arches spanning more than you can say 6 meters and they said this is actually a small table I found it in a construction book uh, which is actually a textbook for the Diploma of Associate Engineers. See you in the next video.